How's it going guys and girls? Welcome back to The Walking Dead with Sean. Welcome to episode 3. So in the last episode, we were captured by Randall and um, his people. Uh, we've been mistaken for thieves because these two stole something apparently. Um, so yeah, let's see where it goes. I don't know where we're being taken, but you know. Chatter, you speak when spoken to, understand? I don't want. All right. You. Let's start with you. So. What's your name? Oh shit. You can tell Fuck me. Fuck you. Fuck you. <laughs> that's not even an F or a PH. It's all right. You don't have to tell me. That's what I would. I'll just call you thief. Thief. We didn't take anything from you. Shut your mouth. I'm talking to you. The cohort. Bet we're not the only ones you've stolen from. I didn't steal shit from you. Then you've got nothing to worry about. What's that? Let's see here. Ah, it's fine. Nice machete. It is. You handled those walkers back there. Got it. Now you will get something that can actually fight back. I'll kill you one hit. Plenty sharp. Let me show you. Untie me, and I'll show you. <laughs> I'll bet. <laughs> Let's go. Something like this, you gotta be comfortable. Believe me, my friend. I have gotten messy plenty of times before. Who was it for you? Mother? Father? Couple sisters, maybe? Kids? Not kids. You? Oh, man. I wouldn't have guessed that in a million years. Why? Racist. You got nothing left to do. No wonder you're all stolen. Uh, I would spit in his face. I don't really like him, to be honest. You better back the fuck but at the same time, he's got guns on arrows. Probably bad that he's spitting in his face. Besides, you might get the wrong idea. Might go all kinky on it. We don't want that now, do we? Michonne is a committed woman to a machete. It's a unbreakable bond between a weapon and a woman. Sacred. Ah. Ah, can dance to some people. Too busy stealing from us to appreciate our little community. Bet you never gave them a second thought. I bet you mung. We haven't been here before. Say this to Norma. Norma, she sounds fat. <laughs> she is fat. <laughs> She'll be just thrilled to see you. <laughs> hey, don't treat me like that. All right, Pete. Take his eye mask off with respect. Oh. You hurt? I'm fine. Oh, Alright then. I'm fine. He doesn't like a bit of gay love. Thanks. Cheers, bro. I'll uh get this back to the sick bay. Hey. Your job's not done yet. <laughs> oh. Come on. Randall, what's all this? I'd never see you again, Samantha. Norma, I'm not a word. <laughs> Good. Found them on the ferry, along with this. My oh my. That one there. She's the one to watch out for. Yeah, that watch out for you. Chop your head off. Fat little pig. He's dangerous. <laughs> Probably want to crash. Um, and when I need to. I'm dangerous when I need to. Aren't we all? 
so dangerous isn't so bad anymore. You survive if you're dangerous. You can respect that. Oh yeah. I'm in. Pulled, pulled. Randall, escort these ladies to the storeroom. Find somewhere comfortable for the other two. What? what? That's my brother. Hey, I'm not liking his treatment here. Women's equality, rights, and all that good stuff. I want a comfy chair. Son of it, Pete. It'll be fine. There's only one person escorting us. We should probably just like ambush him. There's two of us. I mean, yeah, we are tied up actually. Um, I don't know. Just throw our bodies on the person and then see where it goes from there. Pick up a gun with your hands behind your back. Just shoot. Oh, that's better. I oh, know it's two people. Yeah, bad idea. Don't you worry about him. What about Greg? He go die. Looks a bit empty, doesn't it? It does. Something's missing. What's Luckily, missing? My sister's good at getting answers. She'll find out what we did to the rest of them. And if she doesn't, the two of us are gonna have ourselves a talk. Well, I'm not gonna let ah, I want my own to chat. Maybe a lovely. She's got a knack for starting trouble. Anything goes down, and I'm blaming you. No, all of me. I don't take orders from you. You should reconsider. I'd say make yourself comfortable. <laughs> Probably not gonna happen. <laughs> ah, you jokes suck. Oh, we've got to get out of here. You're gonna hurt Greg. These people. Oh, I'm worried about, about Pete too. too. Do you steal us up? Did you steal the supplies? Well, I didn't steal the duffel bag, if that's what you're asking. That doesn't really answer my question. This is my fault. I'm so sorry. I, I was just trying to protect my family. That, that's all. I never thought they'd go back to the ferry. I didn't know. It's not going to be okay. What the hell is going on here? I just wanted to use the radio. To reach people. I never expected that Randall would show up there. Not after. <sighs> Ties are too tight. Do you see anything we can cut him with? Anything. Let's have a look. Get cigarettes. We can't really do anything there. Sam. Why first? <laughs> yeah. I think we're out of luck here. I'm sorry. There might be. A knife in there. Uh, taking it from the ferry. Uh, like to slip my hand out. This used to be full. How should I know? Cigarettes. There's nothing you can really uh, cut their hopes with, to be honest. Touch some. Hey, Sam. Is that it? Are you looking? We gotta find something. There's nothing. I don't think. They took the life vest too. Oh, well, I'll just really love their cigs. look at everyone. Same brand that was in the duffel. This is why there was nothing left on the ferry. It's all here. Look at a little teddy bear. Do you like a bit of teddy bear? Uh. Look at Robo, Chompy, Mr. Grumplefur. Grumplefur. We do love Grumplefur. Back in the Grumplefur. I was messing stuff. Whoa, my God. That is crazy. Is 
there's something that I can do. I'm trying to help you. I'm... I, I know. That's weird. Come on. If you want to get out of this, I need you to tell me the truth. You saw those bodies back at the ferry? Yeah. That was another group. We traded with them sometime. All right. Randall killed them all. Everyone. Sorry. Even the kids. He came with his whole crew. And he just murdered them. They were trying to run away. Son of a bitch. No, okay. You probably don't believe me, but I'm just interested in what she had to say. Just begging. Then they took what was left. That's why they stuck in here. Mm. That's what they do. They think they own everything on the water. Whatever they find, they take. And if you put up a fight, well, you know what happens. You die. Well, not with Michelle. Just, if you fight, they kill you. They could try, but they'll never kill Michelle. About, don't tell these people we're scared. Someone's coming back. I feel like getting trying to escape so this could be a bad idea really. This is our chance. <laughs> Albert, where are you gonna go? We can do this together. We're not gonna be able to get everyone. <clears throat> it's not the time. No. The time's not now. I'll get us out of here, but not like this. Just wait and follow my lead. Okay. Just think just like we get we get the person, we jump them, we take the gun, then then what do we do? We just walk out of there and rescue the other two people. It's not gonna happen really. I think I made a good choice. Quiet down here. Here I was, ready for a fight. Nice work. Catch the gun. Which is good. Because Norma wants to talk. Come on, I promise. What about Greg? Well, that's what Norma wants to talk to you about. Mm. Interested to see what happens here. If we haven't done anything, we've just been caught up in a bad moment, but. Uh, I feel like we should help Sam and Greg just because they they sort of got unlucky really and these people sort of like dickheads. So, Michonne. Uh what's her name again? Sandra? I feel like Sandra. Not oh, Norma. That's it. Norma? I don't know. Norma? <laughs> yeah. I always wanted to be a Veronica. <laughs> You're lucky though. You got a name people remember. Yeah, that could be a bad thing. <laughs> Don't kiss my ass. I just get to the point then. I'm sorry about all this, but I just want to talk. That's all. Huh? What's up? Taking these off? <coughs> sure. Oh yeah. I get to know you better. Oh. I know you're angry, but try to consider things from my perspective. Alright, speak. Go on. What have we, what we got? You don't have to me a drink. You just a drink. That's not how you see it. Enlighten me. Help me understand. Oh, you are surely a poor host. I 
I'll be happy to remove them for you. Let's talk. You know me? Let's talk. That's what I like to hear. Oh, I. You're gonna help me get to the bottom of things. You do that, you get to go home. Go on. I'll take the drink because I'm quite thirsty. Gotta get on a good side, don't I? There you go. <laughs> I don't like that guy, the Randall guy, but so you know, you she's a leader. How long you all been together? Haven't seen you. Uh, oh, just that. I just met Sam today. Really? And what brought you to that ferry? Seems awful strange you just stumble on it out there in the middle of the uh, I don't know. Difficult to laugh. Heard a radio signal. Our boat got stuck. At the exact same time I think we're in the area. I don't really give away anything about where we are. Watch what happens. <laughs> it's not an answer. You keep wasting our time dodging questions. We're gonna have a problem. Sorry. Okay, Francis, bitch. The only reason you're still sitting here is because I've decided to let you tell me your side of things. I suggest you stop fucking around. Oh, you're hard. Otherwise, this is gonna stop being so pleasant. Don't mistake my kindness for stupidity. I'm telling you what I know. I have a hard time believing this. Well, then, that's your problem. So here's the deal. You're gonna tell me what I wanna hear. How many of you are out there? I need to know who's with me. Can't act on this. There's nobody else. There's nobody else. Someone said before, Have don't tell shit about people. Complete bullshit. Hi. Language. All Missy. Right, then. I know how this whole thing must look to you. I get it. But there's more to this than you realize. Like what? Since you just met, there's something you should know about Samantha. Right then. Enlighten me. That girl is a natural born liar. Liar. She's good. I'll bet she laid it on thick for you. Said it was all her fault. She's sorry and won't you please help her escape big bad Norma? Am I getting warm? Uh, getting close, yeah. She said that line to somebody. Uh, I don't really know if she's right about you. I, I just silence. I don't really know what to say. She's lied to us before. Stolen from us before. You can see why I might be just a tad frustrated. I mean, I let her go. No consequences. Yeah, my first told me too. I'm glad to hear you say that. Yes. Not a lot of good people left, don't they? Yeah, unfortunately. There's a fine line between being generous and being taken advantage of. Everyone deserves a second chance. I believe that, but never a third. Never a third. Most people were put. Uh, I don't know. Two chances is generous. About the people on the ferry. What about those people on the ferry? Children, whole families, executed. How many chances did they get? No, we didn't do that. Scavenger killed those children, their families, oh, everyone. God. Then they took over. So Randall went down there, gave those murderers justice, made sure they'd never kill again. Doubt that. That's what we do here. Protect people. <laughs> Once again, doubt that. In, see that they're fed, clothed, looked after. What about what you take from them? The salvage. We need the same things anybody does. We pool our resources, we survive. I'm not telling you anything you don't know. What's no this? More beating around the bush. Where's the rest of it? I don't what? know you, Mom. You say you weren't with those kids, but Randall caught you with them. Yeah. You have this, but there's still much more missing. So, 
Where is the rest of it? Oh, fucking no. Bullet, an ammunition, a handgun. I've got no fucking clue. Of course you don't. Yes. Now you get it. Bring in the kid. What, what are you doing? Oh, God's sake. Here's how this is gonna work. I know he's not gonna talk to me. His sisters probably fill his head with all kinds of stories. So you'll be asking the questions. Let go of me! I guess being a pain in the ass won't do a thing. Yeah. Oh, see. Greg, is it? We're just gonna do a little fact check on Greg. See if his story squares up. That's <sighs> what no he's saying. I'm talking to you after what your brother's done. <laughs> Walk. Shit, Randall. Fuck you. You want another one, Randall? Yeah, do it. Michonne. Yes. Mind asking Greg what I asked you? No, Greg. So, oh, can you Greg. tell me? Uh. Second part. How long have we been together? A uh, long time. <laughs> We're all family friends. Hmm. What? That's not how Michonne told it. She says you just met. Someone's full of shit. He's just scared. Him be. Kids are liars. Oh god. I'm just gonna leave it actually. Let's try again. Michonne? The one about your people. You remember, don't you? Ask him yourself. How many of you are there? There are. There's more of us. Lots more. Okay, fuck. Well armed too. Well, that's disappointing. She said it was just you four. What? What are you even on about here? Rando, go! go! Please, I'll tell you whatever you want! Aim that at me! I dare you. Hell no. I just shoot you. I mean, go ahead, but, you know. You have a dirty floor, aren't you? Ah, he pissed himself. Fucking goddamn it, Greg. Fucking hell. Is he lying again? Try to be kind. Go fuck yourself. I don't like her anymore. I'm just gonna be a bitch. God. Take your shot at me. Didn't even hurt. That's all you got. But fake. God damn it, for fuck's sake, Randall. Norma, please, okay, this isn't working. You're not gonna get what you want this what way. You fucking suggest. <laughs> Pat on the head and a lollipop. You got a point, Randall. You took it too far. Hey. Like you always do. People Monk. need a firm hand. You're not gonna get him in line by being soft. Now, being smart isn't the same as being soft, Randall. We're not going to get what we need your way. Zachary and I will figure this out. You go below and get the other folks. You make quite the pair of liars. What can I say? Natural born liar. Try to tell the truth, but uh, you don't believe it, and this guy's uh, full of shit. So, yeah. Okay. <laughs> fine, blood. Fine. What do you think? <laughs> Are we done with this? <laughs> or is it gonna get worse? It's gonna get worse. My guess is. Well, it's gonna keep, keep together shit right. together. Well, what do you think I'm doing? No. Even if it didn't work. I'm pissing me. yourself. One for I piss myself. <laughs> My little brother's 15, you know. <laughs> I've never done that before. Piss yourself. Never. Good. <laughs> I'm not like that. Afraid. I'm not gonna tell anyone what happened to you. Appreciate it. <laughs> it's alright. Sure the smell still give it away. <laughs> I knew about the robbers and don't pee jeans. before it kills them. It's bad. But people are worse, aren't they? Sure are. I didn't know it was this bad. 
They know what they're doing. People, walkers, there's no difference. You want to keep living? Trust me, so. No one else. Sounds like a fun life. Man. Sure is. Thing is, is I, I say that about people, but people, family, they're the only reason I live. What if you don't even have a family? Hmm. Well, that's when you hunt. Regardless. What do you do then? You lie to yourself to live, but if you don't. Stop. Right. I'm going to have to end that episode there because I want to keep the episode length down because the episodes are just getting a little bit too long at the moment and I really need to cut them down because I don't want you people to get bored. But anyway, hopefully you enjoyed this episode. It's been another really fun episode. Stay tuned for the next episode coming out real soon. If you enjoyed this video, guys and girls, please do leave a like. Don't forget to subscribe. See ya.